The problem when you think of traditional exoskeletons is that people envision Iron Man. They think of this device that's big and heavy and strong, but if we've learned anything over the last 30 years, it's the whole foundation for traditional exoskeletons is wrong. We're building devices out of metals and motors, and as a result, we haven't been able to reach the goal, which is a lightweight, low-cost machine that we can use in everyday life. So in order to make good on the dream of exoskeletons, we're making exoskeletons a different way. And as opposed to the metals and motors that dominate conventional machines, we're making new devices that are primarily made out of fabrics and plastics. It's only by making devices that are significantly lighter and lower cost than conventional machines that we can make them fulfill the goal, which is to be in real people's lives and impact the way we live them. So our devices excel because while well, the concept is really simple, is power is good and weight is bad. We can add more power for less weight than any device that we've ever seen to date by having a specific power that no actuators to date have been able to match, allows us to do things that no one's ever dreamed of. And so our early devices have actually shown people running faster, running for less energy. We have a team that's built exoskeletons for a decade at this point, and our goal is we came together to make exoskeletons that can actually live in everyday life. We're developing a novel ankle product that enhances running and walking. All you need to do is connect it to your shoes, strap it onto your ankle, and you're ready to go. It uses our patented pneumatic actuation to provide torque and assistance at your ankle as you're moving about your day. You don't even know it's there. The device senses what you're doing and then it provides assistance as you're going about your motions. Runners can use these devices to train, to pace themselves, to cover longer distances. We're also using our pneumatic technology to create a knee device to provide assistance at your knee, to help you with things that you do in your everyday world. The device is designed to make it as easy as possible for you to integrate it into your life. It's sensing what you're doing and it's responding as needed. A long set of stairs or hills isn't gonna slow you down. It can augment you as you're going up hills and then it can brace you as you're coming back down. People can use these things in their everyday life. Kneeling, picking things up, carrying heavy loads. The same technology behind these devices can also help you when you're skiing to help people ski longer, ski stronger, ski safer. It's gonna sense what you're doing as you're going down the snow and respond accordingly. It's essentially like intelligent shock absorbers for your legs. It's gonna see that you're turning or that you're going straight down a hill and then attempt to mimic what your quads are already doing and take load off your legs. So the great thing about these devices is you turn them on and you essentially forget them. It disappears on your leg. It feels like you're doing what you want to do and the device is just there to help you. At Rome, we're a mobility company. Our goal is to make people go more, do more, see more. 